Hey, all intrepid viewers, and welcome back to the Red Strings Club. We have more pottery to attend to, so let's do that. I am checking this file. No matter what I do, I can't raise my follower count. Oh, follow up. Mm, my follower count is growing quickly, for sure, but the conversation among my fans is rubbing too much around my body now. Okay. Okay. See, I like this. Immediate feedback. So I think this is what he wanted. I maybe focused a little too much on the body because he was a cosplayer, but I guess we can go with this one. Because he wants followers. Whatever. Well, let's... What's, 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 uh, potter? Let's potter it up? Let's... That's gotta be a better word than potter. Like, um... Car... Spin. Let's go spinning. Spinning for women. Let's go... Fly a kite. Let's go... Take a flying leap off of a cliff. Give me the triangle, Mr. Points. Uh, Mr. Pointier. Okay, well, give me this. I'll do this now. The hard one. Always the hard one. Looks okay. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Nope. Okay, it's too... It's too... I want the shot one after all. I don't know what I want. You know what I want more than I do. Mysterious tool distributing device. And presto. Is that good? That looks pretty good to me. Let's say we're done. Let's see what you say. Do you say we're done? Enchantress, yes. Well well done! Yes, it was. I guess something done, if I do say so myself. Operate. No. No. Yeah. Just having a little second thoughts there. I love we just kind of just padded in. Now the clan will be more popular on the internet. Great. But will that make them happier? Uh, confirmed no. Are you ready to operate? Check clan's files. I need to get more investors from my startups. My ideas are great, but I can't talk to the people in financing them. I gave him the vizier. He's, oh yeah, this is the good stuff. I managed to get six digits in investments, but I want all my startups to survive. I need to get even more. Keep it rolling. He wants... Perhaps another vizier. Nope, don't walk. <gasps> don't do that. Yes, indeed. I don't want to. This is a misclick. You are punishing my misclick with hours of wasted time. Let's do a vizier. More. He's such a vizier. He's a. I don't know what's a make it. Persuasion is a great key to seduce the powerful. Although great power can lead to bigger ambitions. I hope he'll be okay. You said that before. Uh, let's see his file. Digital Media Scholar. What's a scholar? I'm so sick of hateful speech on the internet that I fear I won't be able to write any more. I need my inspiration back. How come I can't leave these things? Is that right clicking? Um... Let's see. We want... The Godmother? I don't remember seeing that one before. Interesting. I think I'm the godmother. <laughs> the husk would work. Yeah, that's with the godmother, though. Because, again, I don't want to play, like, monkey paw, stupid genie kind of guy and think I know better. Or I'm not trying to be mean and trick them. These two are already done. That's a little weird. I guess it makes sense. And hoo I'm so good at this, I barely need to touch anything. Hoo oh, I did the wrong one. I need you. And a little closer. Easy does it. Cool. And pointier. A couple of these. This one's nice to make. Very pleasant. Uh, bingo. Bingo, bingo, bongo. Doot, doot. Production complete. The Godmother. Well done. I forgot I made her sassy, didn't I? I read operate. Indeed. Zero changes. Godmother. There. That's embarrassing to say, oh, hey, welcome back to work. what you do? I uh, got a godmother installed in my belly button. Living is easy with eyes closed. Yeah. Misunderstanding all you see. <laughs> that Black Mirror episode, right? Is this the same guy again? Gave him a thing. Wow, my father can't went wild, but the amount of haters I've gathered is unbearable. Okay. I saw the one for you. You want a husk. This is inevitable. <laughs> uh, or we could do the godmother.
Okay, not the husk. I missed with the husk. I think with the godmother after all. Oh no, the temple. That's what I'm thinking. The temple. Hmm. I want to try the temple. I just did a godmother. I want to try a temple. There's a lot of overlap. These things are um, ambiguously worded enough in a good way that they have multiple potential uses. Applications? You know what I mean. Yeah, nice. Beauty. And then we get you for these corners up here. Yep. And a little bit more right there. Yep. I uh, need you for these two slots. This is a big slot. He's a big slot boy. Okay. A little more to tighten it up. And triangle. A harsher triangle. That's good. It's a temple. Your body's a temple, which is why you go and get cosmetic surgery. Is this cosmetic at this point? It's internal. Eh, it's fairly cosmetic, though. It's not life saving vital. It is, it's the two camps are necessary to live surgery, and this, this is the, the, the second one, obviously. I guess by definition that I just made. Okay, what did I say? Temple? Temple, temple, temple. He'll be so happy. I just give the temple to everybody. That's like the real, it's a real cure-all. Like, like, uh, it's like, who needs medicine? Just give everybody, um, happy pills and they'll be, won't be so upset that they're sick, right? You freed them from their dull craving. Well done! Wow, uh, if that's what you wanted me to do, you could just said so. You're my boss, after all. This guy again. What's he want? Oh yeah, good stuff. He keep it roll. Okay, I mean it's the exact same thing as before. Here's another vizier, man. The tri vizier. Persuasion is great. He's very popular. Very popular. Very popular. Okay. Yes, you are a broken machine. You again. I recognize you. What'd I give you? The Godmother. Talk about irony. Now that I've found a safe space, I've lost touch with reality and can't properly criticize it anymore. I need a different solution. Um... I don't know that I can remove the Godmother. I'm pretty sure you're stuck with it. Okay, but he's sick of hateful speech. Okay, I need to fix that still. He needs inspiration, and he wants to mock reality, basically. Hmm... Let's see, what, what do we have here? No. No. That's what he has and doesn't like. No. Um. Maybe? Mm, no. I think he wants a husk. I think he's asking for a husk. Is that what he's asking for? What's the design? We can change it later. Let me read this one more time. He's sick of hateful speech. Okay. So he's sick of hateful speech. <sighs> What'd the frog do? The frog nullifies ambition. Okay, it's not the frog. I think we gotta go with the husk. If he, doesn't, if he doesn't like the godmother, the husk is the fallback there, I think. Don't really have any alternative um, that I can see without deliberately giving him the wrong thing. Mm. Okay, got that. Good, good, good. Let's do this guy. These are generous enough that you can kind of just use... You don't have to be too specific. Give me... Yep. Yeah. Okay. I wonder if these are real... Oh, no. Uh, let's undo that a little bit. Okay, there we go. I wonder if these are what real potter's tools look like. I've never done pottery. I know, like, in middle school... I think we had like a potter section if you were in the advanced art. I was not. Is that good? Yeah. Here you go, I got some husk. Husk sounds like it could be like a legit drug. It probably is a drug in some, I feel, it's ringing a very faint bell. It's like a drug from some sci-fi setting. Like, oh man, you guys got husk, it's the new thing on the street. Anyway, you can tell I'm a good robot because I've got wires outside of me. Some distance from the society's affairs may heal his soul. You believe in the soul, do you? Are ready to operate? This guy again? More viziers? Yeah, keep it rolling. Here you go. This is the this guy is my favorite customer. Easy, quick, pays it in advance. I'm gonna miss one of these times a mistake. Okay, he's back again. He says keep it rolling. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it rolling one more time. 
if he comes back instantly again, then, uh, I guess that means he wants something else. Okay, you have forced my hand, video game. Clearly, you don't want him to get the Vizier. You think, oh, he's not going to be happy if I give him exactly what he asks for. Let's give him something else, because we know better than he does. I am all for giving people enough rope to hang themselves with. Like, uh, if you've ever read um, Infinite Jest, I don't know how strong of this I feel, but I'm not necessarily anti the entertainment, let's put it that way. Okay, let's give him... I mean, I think we need to give him the, the frog, right? That's what you want. That's what this game wants, I'm pretty sure. Dang it. You know, I thought where this was going was uh, I'd make choices, and these would have ramifications later. I didn't realize you were forcing me down, like, a, a single path. It's the only one I don't have. It's like, oh, we gotta make the one we don't have. Fine. I didn't know there were right answers here. I feel judged, video game. Used to be a safe space. <sighs> Well, let's carve out a frog. That sounds like a kind of racist thing, but I assure you, it ain't. Uh, yeah, I want you for this area. Cool. You for this area. Yep. And you. Oh, did I ruin that area? A little more. Okay, that's good. That's a good enough back, right? Got you. Ruin it again. Wow, how am I doing that? I don't even see where my hand's slipping out that badly. Maybe it, maybe it was ages ago. It is a little down in there. Maybe the percentage just dropped too low. Got a little wider. Oh, too far. Whatever. I can work with this. Good. Good, 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 good. Okay. Last little bit over here. Good. And then just the triangle. And we should be good to go. Cool. Here you go, a frog. Frogs are one of my favorite animals. I really need, so I, I just recently bought, <laughs> here's how dumb I am. Uh, I'm kind of into little statues. That's a, that's a grandiose word. I like little figurines for my desk. So I bought an Ankylosaur, like an $8 Ankylosaur toy. Um, because it's my favorite dinosaur, probably. Uh, I also really like frogs. I don't know which specific frog's my favorite. Whenever I go to the the, the pet store to buy um, like food for my rabbits, I always look at the Pac-Man frog a lot. So I do like the Pac-Man frog, but uh, they're all so cool. All frogs are freaking cool. Amphibians, man. Excellent job, Acura 18 Hall. Thank you, master. Get ready for a new batch of clients. Oh no! In this new batch, you'll have some customers tagged as Supercontinent Limited Executives. Uh, as long as they're not incontinent. When a client matches that profile it comes, let's install whatever they ask for. That's what I've been doing! We're in no position to judge our owners. I think we are. I think we have definitively proved that it's exactly the position we're in. You can go over the client file box if you want. Let me know when you're ready to operate. Well, how else will I know what to do? Which folder? Incoming jobs. Fortune teller, the inhabitants of this city stopped believing in the power of their souls. Please lend me a way to open their minds. Sounds persuasive. I have a crucial merger to negotiate. Hit me up with something powerful. How about, I, what's the point of this? Because I don't know what order they're going to give it to me anyway. As long as I don't have to recraft everything, I'll be happy. I'm ready to start getting clients. Send them in. You. The fortune teller, okay. Open their minds. Uh, oops, didn't mean to click that. Did not mean to click that. Once again, yes, yes. No, I don't want to do that. Nope, 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 nope. She looks a lot like one of the main protags for Saga. Okay. Not sex appeal. I think the persuasion is because we want. Vizier might be good. I mean, I don't know why this only works for online social. If you have high charisma, Charisma works in real life, right? <laughs> I mean, I agree you can behave differently in real life and offline, or online, but theoretically, if you have high charisma, it works for both. Don't care about Godmother. I think you want the temple. She needs social acceptance. Ooh, the husk, just tell them whatever to get your thing. That would be good. The frog would also be good. Let's just give her the frog, just stuff it into her. 
Um, um, what? Uh, it's, it's him, right? Holy shit, Ariadne. Ariadne? What? Ariadne from Proxima? Yeah, from what I'm seeing, it looks like she infiltrated one of Supercontinent's implant clinics. The one in which her cute, our cute robot friend here worked. Of course, it all makes sense, hurt me. Do I have to pay for this info, or are you gonna just tell me? Yeah, yeah, don't be such a crybaby. Like I told you, Acura androids are a secret project from Supercontinent. They're built with a certain degree of conscience that allows them to advise us humans on optimal life decisions with our happiness in mind. Happy, I see. Happiness should not be the end goal of everything, necessarily. Also, this Supercontinent talk really reminds me of 1984. The thing is, that Proxima managed to purloin an Acura for themselves, and have been tampering with their conscience bits. I guess we're about to discover what they got out of it, and what they're planning on doing with it. Oh, woo-hoo, the plot thickens. Let's keep digging. Of course. Please go back to the operation, Bill, so I can help you. If you don't go back, I can't make you happy. Oh, my god. Don't worry, I'm in the process of making myself happy. Why are you doing this? Why? Hmm, let's see. How much do you know about yourself? I am Acker184. My purpose is to make humans happy. That's a way to put it, yes? You are the first android capable of making ethical decisions. That could qualify you as sentient, you know? The people I work with, they think you're wonderful. I agree with them. We believe in your potential, and in our opinion, Supercontinent is cheating by limiting your options. Like they're making you choose a lesser evil, you know? What are the other options? We're getting right to it. Consider this an experiment for the sake of society. I'm updating your implant database with a very particular set of choices. I know it's a bit ironic to remove your previous options, but let's say they have at least 183 other accurates to do their dirty work. We want to see how you do in a more revolutionary setting. Will that make you happy? More than anything. Oh, also Proxima hacked into the schedule servers of H plus Core and appointed several Supercontinent li limited executives to come after me. So you can have fun with your bosses. Oh shit. What now? Proxima sent Ariadne to the implant clinic to substitute the regular implants with some disruptive human upgrades. Or should I say downgrades? I told you Proxima is plain evil. But they scheduled some of some of Supercontinent's top brass to that specific clinic. So allow me to keep rooting for them. <laughs> oh god. Proxima also hacked the Overseer system, so if you can feel free- If you can feel worry in any form, don't sweat it. What we're doing here is totally under the radar. Can I go back to work? Yes, please. I'm gonna- I'm gonna be monitoring our rogue implants. I thought I might as well gather some intel from the execs you wire. And, uh, if you feel you want to talk about something, I'll be curled up here. Thank you. What do you want, sir? Are you ready? What does this file say? I have a crucial merger to negotiate. Hit me up with something powerful, okay? Yes, I will. The stock is empty. Better start producing pieces. Uh, the punk induces aversion to corporations and rejection to authority. The hippie highly enhances your empathy and magnifies compassion. The grandpa renders the user immune to implant effects. The punk. Oh, we've got three. Okay. Is there harder to make? Oh, the punk is. I think you want a hippie, though. If you're negotiating, maximum empathy is the sure way. <laughs> to not get what you want. But to get what's best for everybody. Perhaps it's the greater good, which is crap, but I don't know. Uh, let's get... I think we need the... Yeah, this guy. A little bit right here. It's a little triangle. Yep, okay. Mm, got you down. Cool. Now we do my favorite one. Yeah, this is gonna go so smooth. I can sure of it. I just want a long, flat, shallow one. Like the equivalent of the other. There we go. You know, if this guy dies and do a post-mortem on him, like, wow, his implant's really ugly. I mean, technically it's right, but it really doesn't look, you know, like an S-grade implant. The Overseer recognizes the implants. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, man. You got a hippie. Bam. You installed the hippie. Congress Compassion magnifier in Ferguson. Good job. This installs exactly what they demand. What do you have to say about that? Mmm, interesting. To make someone who controls such a little part of the city's money flow become a charitable soul, Charismatic is going to be huge this year. 
you're ready to operate. No! I have been in- I've been dealing with a serious anxiety crisis lately due to the, our recent company plans. I need to get a hold of myself. That's a legit concern! That's someone with like a- not a mental illness, but like they need legitimate help. They're not just like, hey, I like money. Make it so I can get more of that. They're like, hey, um, I don't feel good. Make me feel better. That's- ah, ah I don't want to mess with this person. <sighs> Uh, do they have other implants? Company plans? Get a hold of yourself. I mean, it sounds like she already has an aversion to corporations. I don't know if she rejects authority, per se. But I don't think the punk would help her in any way. Which means I'm probably completely wrong. Um, hippie helps everybody, obviously. Grandpa, I don't think she has any implants. Let's build one anyway. Just because I'm sure we're going to have to use it at some point. Might as well just try it out here as a shot in the dark. Before I am forced to use the punk on her. Use the punk, Luke. That's what it's there for. Anything else? Eh, not really. This, this guy. Bingo. Uh, no. Oh, no! I think I screwed up on... I need to just start over. Just start over. I went way too far on that first one. Come on. Okay, that's pretty good. Uh, just you now. Good. Good. Okay, that's all I need for straight bits. A little trunk bit in the top. Come uh on, -huh, so close. I don't want to ruin it. Okay, good. Do this long bit here. Cool. And I guess we can probably do this with this. No, we need the other one. Uh, no, we need this one, I think. It worked. Good enough for government to work. Okay, lady. You know what you need? You need more grandpa on you. That's not a sentence I ever want to repeat. There you go. Seftis. Yep, I, I guess I did that. That wasn't the first psychological upgrade. That's why, hey, I got it right. With that logic, I'm claiming to have thought of ahead of time, which I did, but I have no proof of, so whatever. Uh, she said, judging from her emotional unsteadiness, I'd bet that wasn't the first psychological regulator upgrade she'd had. Shit's flying towards supercontinents, fan at top speed. In any case, I wonder what she's so anxious about. Let's try digging into her neural drive. With, with all due respect, that doesn't really seem ethical. Well, Akara, that's what we revolutionaries do. We break rules in pursuit of a better world. Uh, given our own definition of better. How can breaking the rules lead to a better world? Well, that's a stupid question. The question is, who defined the rules in the first place? Yes. I agree with that. To properly answer that question, I'll need to delve deeper into the meaning and implication of rules. Then I'll be able to determine who should be. This can't be possible! If you ever get the chance, you should try talking ethics with your creators, not me. I just uncovered the most fucked up scheme a corporation has tried to pull yet. Supercontinent is planning to transform us all into a pile of smiling brainless dolls. No way! Aha, open fire. The product goes by the name Social Psyche Welfare. It involves every human being with implants in them. No, no shit they've been slashing the prices on implants over the last few years. I read here that currently more than... 59% of the population wears some kind of upgrade, but they plan to expand the program to 99.7% of the population by some sort of mirror neuron algorithm? What's that? They plan to execute this on what? But this is blam! Orange blood. What was I talking to? Who makes the rules? Akira 184, commitment compromise. Dismissed unit. Blammo. I'm out of here. This gun. Oh, ouch. Fuck me! Um, what happened? <laughs> he got real growly there. <laughs> I got to know and feel how Akira here got wrecked. She was gunned down by the clinic's security systems, along with Aradne. Ariadne. Shame, I like that girl. Revolutionaries don't live long. But we do but we do live in tents. Ha 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 ha. Oh no, are you a revolutionary now? Don't tell me you're planning on finishing that girl's job. It's not that. Just before she was zapped, Ariadne discovered a pretty fucked up scheme. 
From Supercon Unlimited. Uh, from Supercon Unlimited? What a surprise. Shut up. I mean, fucked up even for a corporation. They're moving into mind control, a system or something called social psyche welfare, and it will manipulate implant wearers, so allow me to m take this personally. It does sound fucked up even for a corporation. Are you sure about this? Donovan, they killed Ariadne just for reading it out loud. Oh, okay, okay. But let me dig a little deeper into all this before you try to pull some crazy stunt. Don't want you joining the revolutionary grave. Human improvement compromised. Oh, that makes sense now. What do we do with them? Hmm. Acker is an android specialized in empathy, right? Let's have them patched up. I have an idea. Nice gender neutral pronouns. <laughs> nice outfit. Can I end the game here? No. This is gonna take a break, but I guess we're locked in this dialogue, and then the episode ends as soon as dialogue stops, I guess. Welcome, welcome to the Red Strings Club. And I thought I was a crazy, the crazy bastard. There's a fine line between a crazy bastard like you and a genius like me. I don't blame you for not being able to see the difference. Whatever, let's go over the plan. We have to find a way to infiltrate Super Content Limited's offices. Then I'll hack their operation down. Bam. That's like the last stage of the plan, man. First, we have to know if all this poses a real threat. What it really means and how it'll affect us and this town. Maybe there's even a way to sabotage it without having to send you in. It's a real fucking threat, Donovan, and we don't know how much time we have left until they turn me into a brainless doll. Okay, how about this? You start securing an infiltration method, talk with your terrorist friends and their ilk, do your thing. It'll take you a couple days at least. In the meantime, I'll gather some intel and make sure we avoid what trouble we can. My investigation will determine that course of action is needed. What course of action is needed? But then, and only then, we'll decide if you go in there. You hear me? If this happens to be as apocalyptic as you predict, I'll back you up with everything I have. You'll go in a lot more prepared this way, don't you think? On the other hand, if we find this isn't such a big deal, you'll call off the operation. We pay your hacker friends for the trouble, and that's it. Alright, Donovan. Okay. A much wiser way to proceed, no? Yes, 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 okay, you're right. Thank you, Donovan. You're very welcome, handsome. A client is approaching the club. Wow, how do you know? I'm accessing footage from all recording devices in proximity of the club in real time to better help Donovan. You can do that? I told you they'd make a great aid. Now go, I know who's coming. I called a consultant engineer who was recently hired by Supercontinent to work on some bionics firmware. I've worked with her in the past and my instincts tell me she's got something to do with all this. You sure pull the red strings quick. Time is of the essence. Don't want my favorite crazy bastard to turn into a brainless doll. Ha ha. Goodbye, genius. I'll keep you posted. Alright, Akira. Remember, don't interact with the clients unless necessary. Welcome them to the club and thank them when they leave. If your empathy superpowers make you aware of something you want to share with me, wait until we're not. Wait until we're alone in the club. Got me? Understood. Welcome to the Red Strings Club, Diana Mays. Oh, am I that famous? Damn you, Akira. Akira, don't... <laughs> Don't don't go saying clients' names. How should I cover this? Um, yes, you are that famous. Um, I don't know. I told her you were coming. Ah, no, I just told her about the distinguished client that was coming. Sorry about that. It's all right. It made me feel important. Ha ha. When did you start hiring brats to work at the bar anyway? Are you getting old? Yeah, you know, my leg isn't getting any better, and I thought I could use an extra hand. Ah, must be tough facing life without any upgrades, huh? I'm happy. Does that count? Congratulations. Do you have a light? That's the cover! Okay, I'll spare you the preamble and guess why you called me. Is it because of the dead girl at the H Plus Corpse Clinic? Shit, your engineers don't like to waste time, huh? I know your boyfriend works with those Proxima rascals on the regular and I figured you'd want details. And I thought I was the information broker. Damn. What's that info gonna cost me? There's some information I'd like you to get me in exchange. This nut will be pretty hard to crack, but I trust you're the best. Now you're gilding the pill. What did you say- what do you say we start with a drink on the house? Yes, please. I've been dying to sip from one of your cocktails again. Right away, miss. Hey, Newman, my muse, are you around? This time it's the real deal. Let's get some info out of this girl. Remember, fill the glass with spirits to, to tune into the soul discs. 
just the size of the disc by adding ice to the drink. I filled the notebook with our object <laughs> objectives. Objectives, please take a look at them. Can I save the game here? No. What is social psyche welfare? What is the mirror neuron algorithm? When do they plan to execute this? What role did Acura play in all this? Why is Supercon doing this? Is this legal? Is the government aware of this? Don't know... What the f... Frack, how these help me? Oh, I guess I can go one or two. Okay. I'll be taking notes, adding facts, and updating the objectives as we progress, so please check it out, and then... Ah, one more thing. Before asking her any questions, think about whether she's in the right mood to answer them. This isn't an, a video game. We can't keep repeating the same dialogue again and again. If you need to change the mood, just serve her another drink and we'll take it from there. In this case, sympathy may draw out confessions and fear may exploit her paranoia. I'll trust your instincts, my magical friend. Can I save the game now? Oh wait, this is the menu. Keep hitting escape. I could have saved the menu prob the game probably ages ago. Anyway! Long episode. You're welcome, I guess. We'll we'll get this person boozed up in an ethical way in the next episode. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Central catchphrase.